Hi, Kickstarter supporters. Dr. Eric here. It's been a while since I personally sat down and chatted with you, so I wanted to give you a direct update. Our team is going full throttle right now. We are only going to ship a finished product that is deserving of your investment and belief in us. We could not, in good conscience, do it any other way. We are facing a delay, and this update will explain the reasons why, along with our revised game plan, to get the best possible free waves product to you as soon as possible. So where are we now? We just started a great partnership with a very impressive and experienced engineering team to get us past the finish line. These engineers are experts in Bluetooth true wireless stereo, pulse oximetry, and have a deep experience with consumer electronic products, including wearables. Our CEO, Mike Kahn, is now going to give you more specifics on our engineering and product development initiatives. Hello, Kickstarter backers. I'm Mike Kahn, the CEO of FreeWaves. And as Dr. Henson mentioned, we do have a new contract engineering firm that has partnered with us. We're really excited about that. These guys are award-winning. Uh, they actually were recommended by CSR. That's the, uh, the brains of the FreeWaves that processes uh, the technology, the music, and the pulse oximetry and uh, also communicates uh, Bluetooth with the FreeWaves itself. So uh, we're really excited about these new team members to be with us. Now you may be asking yourself, well, why do we need new contract engineers as part of the FreeWaves team? One of the challenges that we discovered was um, it's not so easy to process pulse oximetry data. We're picking that data up at uh, 100 samples per second as well as the uh, music at the same time. So these are things that were a challenge for us and what was happening when we tried to do it before. It would cause a, a stuttering of the integrity of the signal and we would wind up either getting uh, the free waves to stop working or pause. And that's no good for you as your Kickstarter backers or the consumers that will eventually be buying this product in major retail. So we went in and we're going to do what's called a major board spin. Um, there are two choices, door number one. Door number one is we split the processing of the CSR chip uh, to have one side of the freeways manage the music only and one side of the freeways manage the pulse oximetry only. By doing that, uh, two heads are better than one, so to speak. That will allow us to process two data points simultaneously and get a great result. And it, it's a major board spin, but it's not a, uh, it's not a huge uh, change. It's going to take some time to do. The, the second door, door number two, is the door that we don't want to go down, and that would require that after we uh, go um, the testing route of splitting the processing between the left and the right side, we still determine that we need a little bit more uh, processing power, and that means adding a coprocessor to the board. By adding a coprocessor, think of it as adding a turbocharger to your car. We get a boost of processing speed, and that will more than handle the issues about uh, simultaneously sound our uh, music listening while we're getting pulse oximetry updates. But that takes even more time. The other thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna go in and we're gonna uh, redo the routing while we're in uh, redesigning the boards, and that will help improve uh, Bluetooth integrity and uh, the signal strength between the units. They've been performing very well so far, but we wanna even take it up and kick it up a notch. And as long as we're going inside the board uh, to either uh, separate the processing between left and right ear or add a coprocessor, uh, we wanna go in and, and we do our routing, our electrical routing to improve our Bluetooth integrity, uh, improve the RF quality and reduce noise. So that being said, those uh, major updates, that's going to be a uh, board spin that will require about 60 more days of engineering. Um, right now we're at the middle of April. Um, that's gonna put us through to the end of June, approximately the end of June, um, before all the engineering is done and we're ready to start uh, testing the final betas. And then we'll release it to uh, manufacturing in July. So I know this is uh, not great news. It's something that we at Freeways don't want to do, but the important thing is to get you the best quality there. And that's why we decided to do a video update for you. And we will continue to maintain these and do great updates for you to keep you in the loop of what's going on with the freeways. We're really excited to get you the best quality, wire-free sport fitness earphone. Back to Eric. We are doing something that is truly revolutionary by making free waves completely wire-free as well as implementing medical-grade pulse oximetry. No one has ever done this combination before. We have run into some challenges, but we are working our way through it. We can see the finish line and our team 
is, continues to drive forward with the passion and commitment of getting the best free waves on your ears. I and the entire team at Free Waves can't thank you enough for your continued support and enthusiasm for the Free Waves. Thank you for believing and again for supporting us. We feel confident that what you will receive will be well worth it.